Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Baldur's Gate 2 Shadows of M. This is gonna be RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that you're to join me today as I set up everything so we can sleep. And you'll see why, you'll see why. Terrible things, terrible things await us beyond that corner. So what I will do is I'll disable the AI so I have more control over my spellcasters. And I'll bring my spellcasters... And I'll say it like that, because that's weird. Um, and I'll bring them over here, and I will cast fi Oh, no, 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 that's not good. Uh, well, it's not too bad. It's not it's not terrible. Let's see what happens. So bring Minsk up. Enable the AI, so they'll start attacking. There's there's a bigger door here than I thought there was going to be. And these guys are pretty nasty, but if he, he can... What is do it you now? have... You dumbass, you are not using the Mace of Disruption. Use that thing! Murder that guy! Murder him in the face! And that's... Was that the one? I think that was the one. Who? He took damage from Jahiras. No, it wasn't the one. But still pretty good. Okay, so that means... Ooh, yeah, that, 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 that was the level up I was looking for. Mm-hmm. Okay, that's pretty good then. Uh, so we got experience there. Minsk has leveled up because he's a good... He's a good guy. Let's see. So he's got proficiency slots, which is very nice. Got moved silently and uh, hide in shadows. Also, reduce taco. Fantastic. One additional priest level, three spell. That's... Awesome. Uh, and uh, the hit points gained, not that great. Let's see what we can do here. Actually, actually, two-handed weapon style, what's that for? Specialized. The wielder gets a further minus two bonus to speed factor, so he's gonna attack like a crazy man. Like a freaking crazy man. I'm gonna do that. I, I wonder how much he can go up to. He can go up to master over here, but on this one he can only go up to specialized. Yeah, okay, so he's gonna be over there on... On that, so he's already pretty good. Can I bring him up over there? Nope. Yep. He's basically at his uh, ultimate form, uh, which is all manner of weird things going on. So let's see what I am. Oh, cure disease would be a nice one. Yeah, because we ne we never have this. Oh, we don't use that too much. But in the first game, it was totally pointless. But in this in this one, it's a little bit more important. But look at that! I slept for no reason. All I have to do. Oh, we have no. Uh, that that is a reason. Please don't attack Minsk. Okay, that's the reason. That's the reason. Disable the AI. Bring our spellcasters in here, in a way that doesn't get them killed or anything of the sort. Bring them... Okay, so we're good here. The reason why that is the case is because... And actually, Herr Dallas doesn't have fireball. I need to buy that for him for him or something. Uh, the reason why that is because we have fireballs galore. So I'm going to throw a few fireballs over there. And mostly two. Just two should be okay. And one of them goes off and Marcus gets away from there. That's a little bit of damage. A great Amumi. Or mummy saves us a spell, and I think they all died. No, they didn't. There's a skeleton warrior over there. That is not great. So enable the AI, and uh, a greater mummy. Yeah, let's attack the skeleton warrior. It's not. It's not too bad. It's not as bad as bone golem, or whatever the thing that it was. Where? What happened to the mummy? Did it die? No, it didn't. I wish. I wish it had. Come on, no animal. Interesting. It no, it's not interest. Oh, Jahira, she's taking damage. That's from a great mummy. As long as it doesn't drain her levels, we shall be okay. I'm not really sure why she's taking damage. Disengage. Let's get out of there. That. No, not next time. Right now. Uh, it's going down. Ow. There it is. Good. So now you heal yourself up, please. It is good to adventure in such a Wait a minute. The blood quickens, knowing that evil is so near. No, no, the blood quickens because I'm gonna punch you in the face if you don't shut up. Uh, so let's bring her up again from there. We're gonna take another healing thing right there. And she needs another one. And I have a cure series. Let's go with a, one of these. So he's at, already at maximum. She's gonna take a couple. And uh, another one. Because, you know, for these ones heal for eight. It's not. There's no point in using it over there. And we got dealt... We, we, these guys got dealt with. That was... No, actually, they didn't get dealt with. Let's just pick up that thing, see what happens. Uh, two-handed sword that goes in here, and we got that over there. Oh, I, how I love the bag of holy holding. It's so good. Basically, that allows us to just go through all of our travels, not even bothering with things. Just, we don't bother. We, oh, there's a trap. Don't bother with that. Oh, there's a uh, uh, cobalt. Oh, that's nasty. This cobalt's firing thing. What, what did he do, actually? He takes... Does he have... Is this guy ranged or something? How did he... I'm not really sure. Well, there it is. Uh, nope, Misk is taking quite a bit of damage. It's not too bad. Go right ahead. I don't have my abilities. I want my special abilities. Come on. And of course, what you can uh, deduce from that, from the fact that we don't have our abilities, is that the abilities were given to us f um, because of... Um, because of our heritage, so, yeah. 
that's what we learned. But don't worry, it's all gonna be fine. We're gonna succeed in the game if you don't know how the game goes on. Well, it has an ending, and the ending is not with us dying. Well, it can be. Well, I don't remember, actually. I don't know if it is or not, but it, you succeed. It's a happy ending. It's, it's fine. It's, it's, no spoilers. I mean, of course it's a happy ending. This is not a Russian, Russian ending game. Not to say that Russian games always have a, 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 a bad ending or an unhappy ending, but the Russian ending sort of thing... Yeah, that's a thing. That's a thing. So let's see what we have over here. Hopefully no traps. We got a couple of bows or arrows. Got these. Pretty nice. I really don't know if the bag of holding is because of size or because of weight. I believe it is because of size, not because of weight. So that's one of the reasons why I'm car Well, one of the reasons why I'm carrying these around here. Let's see. Dart of wounding over there. You, sir, need to start using these a little bit more. Uh, so yeah, use those a little bit more. Uh, and we have a Resist Fear that she needs to learn. We have an Emerald over there. We have Arrows of Biting and a Bolt of Biting as well. We have a Cleric Staff. Weren't we gonna buy this? Or did we... Staff of Curing. This one gives plus two armor class. It also has the ability to cure, which I forgot, and heals for... A bunch, actually. Range on touch on one creature. It's a pretty good staff. This one is a plus three, plus three. So there's no real reason to have it over... The oh, no, actually there is, because this one is a plus one. So as good as that is, I think the staff of... Uh, the cleric staff, especially considering she's a harper. Not a cleric, but a harper. Let's do that. And I might myself use the... I can't. Who can use this? You guys can. Yeah, it's not weird at all for you guys to use this. No siree. So, yeah, I, th I think the Staff of Curing is going to be kept around, I guess. Uh, I can keep it over here. Uh, just, you know, we might we might want to use it later or something. It's, it's, it's a curing item right there. Not that I'm going to remember that I have it, of course. You know, because, you know, I am, yeah, you know. Uh, so let's learn this. And there it is. Fantastic. No traps that I can find. The AI is on, so she is finding them. Let's see. So we have some access point over to there. This place looks like a very nice place to be in. Uh, there looks like a library in there. Everything is good. Send her in. Send Marcus in as well. You point, for traps. I punch. You're gonna check out over there. No traps around here. Okay. And as I click there, I would just take damage right there. That wasn't, that wasn't the, th the case, fortunately enough. I'm gonna need to look at those, uh, ammos. No, I don't need that. What is this? The history of Tethyr. Tethyr, yeah. Do we go there in, uh, in uh, Neverwinter Nights, the first one? I think we go to Tethyr, don't we? For the past 1500 years, Tethyr has had a single strong royal family ruling with absolute power. Yeah, we read this before, I think in the original game, the, in Baldur's Gate 1. If you haven't seen my Baldur's Gate 1 Let's Play, I highly recommend you do. Because it was a lot of fun and it's actually, I, I prefer that game in some aspects to Baldur's Gate 2. It's just some aspects. Not a whole lot. We have the history of Sembia and the history of Dambreth. And again, the reason why I'm checking these books is because some of them might have a quest for us. I think it's a couple of books that are that have quests, but I don't actually remember. So I'm going to check them all, or try to check them, the ones that uh, I might suspect of having things. So we had the history of the Red Ravens, Unicorn Run, and the history of Amn. For the glory of Amn! Is that how they say it? It's not how they say it, but it's what they say, I think. So let's see what we have here. We got uh, arrows of piercing, arrows plus two, very nice. Darts of stunning, so he gets that. Arrows plus two can go over here. You, sir, thank you very much. You have bullets plus two. Who's carrying these around? That's you, Minsk. You carry that, and you don't. Please, thank you. Uh, and actually, no, you do. You do. I just... There, you, there it is. We got arrow of piercing. Goes over here. We got Finger of Death. What does that do? The Finger of Death spell snuffs out the victim's life force. The caster points his finger at the victim after... So basically it's a save versus spell with a minus two penalty. A creature that successfully saves it still receives 2d8 plus one points of damage. It's a level seven spell with a uh, casting time of five. Hopefully it's, uh, it's ranged. Yeah, visual range of the caster. Very, very nice. Points of finger effectively ripping the life out of its body. Yeah, so basically murdering people with a minus two penalty. This thing is phenomenal. I will just say that many times, hopefully, as, as I use it to great effect. But as I fail to, go to kill do that... that Come on, let's kill something. <laughs> yeah, right. We'll kill somebody in a little bit. She needs that, you need that. Uh, this is power word stun. She might want to use this. This is high level, isn't it? Yeah, she wants this one first because he never gets to high level. Well, I, he will be getting to high level, so but not right away. So um, give me just a little bit and I'll be right back. 
And that's the spells taken care of. And uh, let's go up here first. Although, oh, didn't mean to zoom in. Ooh. Yeah, it looks like this is where we want to go. Good, good. Let's not go there. So first things first, let's send her in. We could have... Can she sneak? She does. She doesn't actually sneak too well. What's her skill level at that, by the way? Hide in shadows. 25. Holy crap, that is awful. Actually, Minsk could sneak. He can't for some reason. Is it because of armor? Yep. Yeah, seems to be because of armor. No, nope. my battle cry may give me away. Don't... Yeah. It's, it's, it's a thing. It's a thing that happens. We look to have... Oh, wait, wait a minute! Look at that, he's still hidden in the shadows, so he can't hide. But he's leaving shadows. He's still hide it, hidden, but... Yep. There it is. Yeah, it's uh, it's an interesting thing. With the uh, armor there. This really looks like a place there's gonna ha that where's, where there's gonna be traps. It actually reminds me of the chest, uh, the chest place with, uh, in, uh, Duram, uh, Dur Durams? Dur Durlag, Durlag's tower. Yeah, remember the chest? Yeah, reminds me of that for some reason. It's, it, it's, it's gotta be, oh, no! Okay, can I open it? Can, okay. This is good, um, or is it? Let's have, uh, let's what see, Anoman, come over here. You're gonna need to switch weapons, sir. Right there, and uh, you go over here. She is in bad, in a, oh, I can't close that. Okay, Minsk. Oh, you you're gonna need to go over I there, punch. sir. She's gonna need to come back here. Okay, that's good. Now you attack him, and we all attack this guy. I think that guy is gonna attack Minsk. Nope, Jahira is under their spell. Not a problem. Let's go with the D-spell right there. See if that works. Uh, it might. Uh, okay, so the damage output that they're doing... Okay, Jahira is back under our control. You're gonna switch to that, and you're gonna go into offensive. Uh, and Jahira needs okay. to attack that guy, please. Yeah, forget about him. We'll be fine. Are you still? Come on. Okay, so he's gonna attack that, and Jahira is gonna move away, basically. Oh, there it is. Okay, so now you need to kill this. Where is? Oh, she's over here. I must get aid soon. Yeah, you must. Boo is too young to have to avenge me. Boy. Okay, Minsk might not survive this encounter. That guy is injured, but yeah, this is good. I think this is going well. Uh, you need to heal everybody, sir. Can you? Can you do that? Probably not. Minsk is gonna die. A solid blow. Dash, yeah, of course. You know, my last well, owner always said I was sharp and edgy. So how can we do this? How can we do? Oh, I know of a way. I know of a way. It's pretty easy. Pretty simple. So what I will do is I'll just set up over everybody over here. I'll send her into the shadows if I could, which I can't. But then again, even if I could, I wouldn't be able to, to do anything. So what I'll do is just, I'll just go over here, get her over there. And this auto thinks that, and I'll go over here, open that door. We're fighting just three. And that does it. Okay, now we go in, in and we attack them all. And also, I'll try to save her, because she really is in a bad way. And that's the, the dispel. The dispel didn't work, or did I cast the hasted? I cast the hasted. Okay, well, I have these spells all around. Uh, go right there. And you, sir, switch to that. No, actually, go on in and murder. Murder. Go on in. Yes, that's good. Okay, so, oh, they're attacking from over there. That's not great, but I got the spell right there. Okay, that didn't work with a haste, but whatever. Yeah, you're... Yeah, okay, so now we attack that guy, hopefully. Uh, yeah, you can, you can attack that. It's good. It's good. Uh, yeah, sounds like a good idea. Marcus is taking damage or taking hits or something. I'm not really sure if he's gonna survive that. He is. No, nope, he's taking damage. Okay, that's good. Okay, now you can... No, we can fall back first and foremost. You can heal her right there. You have healing spells. You do not have healing spells. That's fine. Let's just heal her up with all that we have. Uh, oh, they're coming. They're coming. Okay. Uh... Then she's, you know, just do this. They open the door? Oh, the, the door might open automatically. Okay, Jahira, attack that because you do a lot of damage. Okay, Misk is taking the damage now. And that guy's confused. Okay, no, we have this one. Okay, I'm taking damage now. I, am I hasted? Yeah, I am. Awesome. Apparently, the hasted didn't work on on the, uh, the effects I wanted it to not work on. Okay, so let's kill that. Now, he's confused, so he's gonna attack us as well, which is really bad. But Minsk is... Yeah, Minsk, Minsk can take this. 
There it is. It's not full back because that guy's weird. Okay. Now, Jahira, let's do our business here. Just heal him up. Uh, do you have the thing that heals? Je yeah, she does, but not the one that I kind of wanted her to. Uh, she was going around in circles for some reason. I'm not really sure what was going on there. Uh, let's put that over here so I know what you're doing. No, nope, you're not going to do that. You're going to do this. Very good. That's a healing coming on. And there we go. We got another one for her. And of course, if you could heal yourself, but you're confused, so you're going to take a little while. And uh, there it is. There it is. The haste. The, the haste actually helped us a little bit, I would, th I would think. Maybe. Who knows? Save the game there. No, can't save while not in control of all the party. So let's just wait. Nope, sir. Go away. No, I'm going to run circles around you, sir. Oh, boy. There it is. Okay. Whew. Yeah. So Minsk being hasted is going to help us a little bit. Let's send him up. Just... Ooh. There's an exit over here. Let's not go there, then. Let's go this way. And hopefully in a quick fashion. Except for, of course, these two. Unfortunately. So I think the 50% chance is not per spell, but it's per guy, per um, person. There's a 50% chance that the uh, dispel or the remove magic will work. So, yeah, that turned you out point, to be pretty good. I punch. Let's see. Are you going to punch something? or? Oh. Your blood is rather inviting. Stand and speak that I would hear your lies. That Bodhi sent you, didn't she? Are you to kill me, or are you as damned as I? Well... If you are a vampire of her creation, then we are here to kill you, yeah. We shall battle in this place I created, and forevermore it shall be sealed. If I do not have control, then no one shall. Only my hand can open the way. Oh! Huh. Yeah, how do you get out of this place anyway? Ah, I removed the crystals that focus the magic for the door, left it to rot in a pile of refuse. The kobolds have taken it now. They worship the fools. No way out for you. You'll starve here. Starve! Okay, we got a guy named Dace Sontan that apparently is very mad at us. This for whatever reason, he's, he's, he's already attacking Minsk and he's draining him of his level. Oh, actually, energy drain. What's that for? How does that work? Energy drain? Level drain. Okay, so energy drain is a level drain. Not that bad. Oh, the haste goes away. But he dies. I think he just took Anoman. <laughs> just took damage from Anoman. He failed to save versus spell. And his spirit dematerializes. Anoman, you're going to be very upset with this with this thing. What is about to happen. But, uh, well, needs must. Right there. Stinking evil. No, no. Stinking evil. Very important. We will leave no very untouched. important. And, of course, Boo complaints. Boo, Boo is probably is more annoyed by... by uh, I, I, if I were a hamster and I was in the possession of this guy, Swords, and also in his portrait, you can see it over there. He's very mad. So maybe he's just as mad as Minsk. Who knows? Uh, so there's... Oh, there's a thing we can do over here. Let's do that thing. With a tortured cry, Dace has retreated to his coffin upon defeat. If you can find... If you can but find a wooden stake, you can end his miserable, miserable existence for good. I have one, so let's do that. The hand of the staked creature comes loose in your grasp. Your blood is rather inviting. I thank you, Marcus. I am free in death. I must rest. And after I staked the body of Dace Sontan, his soul was freed from the curse of vampirism. Well, I don't really know how that works. So this is the hand that you obtained from the dead vampire Dace. He's got a pretty cool tattoo right there. I'm gonna keep it around because it's gonna be a uh, uh, it's gonna be a quest item. This vampire is truly dead. Coffin reeks of carrion. There is nothing else you can do with it. Good, good, good. <clears throat> okay, so let's get on with our job, with our lives, and uh, well, actually, I'm gonna need to come back for, but I'm gonna do that off camera. I'm gonna pause the episode if I need to and, and come back for uh, for Dahlia. I really want to keep her. Uh, basically, what's gonna happen is. Uh, I don't know exactly how it goes, but I don't want her to I die over here. Stop. I've decided the that. Was not this long, I don't want her to I die, basically. In the, order. the thing is, I don't know when we are given the choice. So I'm going to keep saving and probably I'm going to need to scum back. Uh, scum back? <laughs> just scum, uh, save scum a little bit just to come back and you must try to, uh, party to save her. Forth. Oh, there she is. Look at that. Now, I was just talking about you. Which means that this is the hand that opens the portal. I will gain the experience. 
Uh, oh, and by the way, I, l I checked up online to see if uh, she was indeed stuck in here, and yes, the only character that leaves here is Emoen, so we're going to use that to our advantage, um, and that's because she's quest critical, and the game forces her to leave. Uh, everybody else gets stuck in Spell Hold. It's not just underground, it's the whole island, so I'm hoping that uh, not a whole lot of things happen when I stuck to this statue. Let's see what happens. Focus of power may be restored, and the hand of the builder opens the passage. The way is open. And I gained experience. The experience is more of what, what I'm concerned with, because she really needs that. And uh, he opens his mouth, and we can go through. Okay, so hopefully we'll be able to come back up. Yeah, I think so. Okay, yep. more tests. We have eyes here. I am willing to believe that they are going to be trapped. Because eyes are usually... The, the level designers like putting traps on eyes. Or fine traps isn't that great. Aren't that great, is it? Uh, fine traps, 95. Eh, not that good. Not that good at all. But this doesn't seem to be trapped, so let's just move in. Yeah, seems like a good place to be in. Let's see. Okay. Oh. These halls. These halls. This game behaves a little bit better in terms of traps. Ooh, my minotaurs. Let's bring you back, Minsk. And they're attacking you. Let them come. Let them come. They'll come over here. It's all, all going to be fine. Minotaurs aren't really that terrifying. They're pretty mighty enemies, but uh, they only have, I think, 21 strength. They do a bunch of damage, but that's about that. Disable the AI. Let them come to us and attack now. Enable the AI again. And one of them is dead. Let's see how much experience. 3,000. Yeah, I was right. Less than... Rest, less right than I thought I was going to be because I really thought they'd be, they, they were a little bit more dangerous, but they're not. So we, yeah, they're they're really normal enemies, and protection against normal weapons basically nullifies all of their stuff. That's why solo uh, mage is such a power. That's why solo mage is such a powerful thing. Okay, that is locked. I what should be want? able to open it. Nope. Apparently, the mechanism cannot be opened. Ooh, this one can. Okay. We have a toilet. What is that? A horseshoe? The one that we stop. Shut up. What is it now? Let's go over here and yeah, okay. Let's have Minsk. What are you doing back there, man? Go, go in there. Let's have Minsk touch the horseshoe. You may rotate this horseshoe-shaped wheel. Horseshoe-shaped wheel. And you turn the wheel with all your strength. From the west, you hear a loud creaking, as if a door were being opened. And it were. It were being opened. The door. We got trolls in there. Lovely. Not too bad. They're coming in for us. Let's have you switch weapons. Because that... These are not... Oh, they're attacking him, aren't they? Okay, what exactly is going on? Are you? Ta are they taking damage from uh, m fire? May oh, that's the wounding thing. Okay, that guy... He's gonna go down, don't worry. Okay, down he goes. Now, you attack that, and you're gonna switch to that over here and attack him once. Please... And that's a kill. That's okay, there's another right. one in there. Not that great. That is right, Minsk. Just do your thing. Okay, as long as he goes down. Yeah, okay, so now you go over there. You switch to that again and attack him. And that's a kill. Okay, now you attack him again. He's gonna go down very soon. And I'm gonna disable the AI because I don't want to waste ammo. Just him using ammo, but still. So switch to that and murder. No, it's not. You just don't know how to wield the sword. Because you're a sword. Actually, a sword probably would be pretty good at telling you how to wield it. But you never know. I I, I never considered that exist, existential. Uh, ah! Ooh! I saw that. I saw that. And just it's a spirit troll. I was going to say something. But let's just hope that... Uh, yeah, poison damage. Taking poison damage from here, Dallas. Unfortunately, they only die with fire and... And uh, and ice uh, and uh, acid damage. I don't know what what, what about a this. Solid blow. Man, he's taking a lot. Okay, he's down. So switch everything over there. You're gonna attack him with that. Okay, and then get a switch to that. Uh, put that over there just because I'm OCD like that, and we're good. Now Jahira has got some problem with it. Twelve thousand experience. Man, that guy was tough. Um, Jahira in Minsk. Ability to score drained. And that would be probably strength. Yeah, it's strength. That's okay. That's fine. I don't mean I don't mind that. Mine is a little bit of strength. As long as they're not over encumbered, we shall be okay. Let's bring her over here. Looking for traps, please. Need to enable the uh, AI for that. 
And there's no passage over here. Let's bring you over here as well. Pretty good experience, all things considered. Okay. Let's see what we have. Some good stuff. We have two of those gems. I, If I remember correctly, those are quest gems. Not normal gems, but I might be mistaken. What are these? Mithral token. Ah, yeah. This is a small mineral uh, mithral disc with uh, jagged edges. There's nothing on the disc that hints at its use. You can't put it over there, but this is indeed a quest item. So let's bring it around over here. Put it over there, and we're good. We got arrows plus two. That's pretty good over here. Not gonna use that, sir. Uh, he can't use that because he's over encumbered. You can carry these around. We're good. Put it over there. Okay. And we have Breach, which everybody knows, fantastically enough. And everybody has, I think, as well. <clears throat> Breach is a really powerful spell, I think. Uh, and then we have the Minotaurs. Uh, that, that ability sc uh, score <clears throat> drain is going to take a little while to, to dissipate. That guy apparently is not going to attack us for some reason. Disable the AI just in case. Man, that guy doesn't attack us? Oh, they do. Okay, enable the AI. Murder. See if that works, of course. What happened? Why do I hear the... A solid blow! Okay, we have something over there. Yeah, Minsk is just taking a little bit of damage. We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, let's send her in. Looking for traps. Oh, come on. I shall go forth at your command. Thank you. That's... that. He just changes mind so easily. So, what is this? Just a pillar? Yeah, looks like... It was something... Oh, it might have been a statue. Do you see this? Yeah, I think it might have been a statue. But what of, of what? A statue of what? Hmm. I do not know. But for right now, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Baldur's Gate 2 Shadows of Amn. I really hope you've enjoyed it, and if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video, but above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. The end is nigh! The end is nigh! The end is nigh! Forgot last episode.